Hello everyone, this is Catherine. Welcome back. I'm here today to show you some stuff that I got on AliExpress. So the first thing that I got is these rainbow pieces. These are resin. They come with 10 pieces. I got that. And then I got these lollipops. You can get all one color, but I chose to get the mixed color. So they gave me these. Then the next thing that I got is some die cuts. I got happy anniversary and that came like this oops I'm sorry still upside down that came like this and I just left it stuck together um, just because it was easier on the die on my big shot and I cut that out in gold it's going on a project that I'm working on the next thing I got was this die, Peacock Feathers, and it cuts out like this, really pretty. Next thing I got were some bottle caps. I got these plain white ones, and those came with 25, and then I got these decorative ones. And I picked the mixed colors, and they come with these jewels on them, and those came with 25, wait, no, I'm not sure how many came in here, but they're 25 millimeter, both of them are. And then I got the clear things to go on top of them, so then you can get the one inch punch and then punch your image out of paper or whatever you want to put here. That's what I'm going to do. Um, is punch an image out and then put it here and then you put this over that and then it's flat on the back so you can still use it for embellishments on your projects. So I got that. And the next thing I got is this mermaid set. And there's these little tiny pieces to her and it took a while to put together but I came up with this so I think she turned out really good and then the next thing I got were these mermaid tails and they're all hooked together and then they came out like this and you could even cut one off or two whatever you wanted to do you could cut them apart or you could use it just like this you could cut out in gold or silver or holographic I think there's a lot of ways you could use this one um, it didn't do the embossing so great on here but it cut out okay The next thing that I got was this die and this cuts out like this and what you're supposed to do with it is put lace or I'm sorry ribbon through it so then I cut it out you see how it just cuts into the paper like that I cut this off and so then I fed ribbon through these right through here so then it comes out like this and then you can tuck the ribbon underneath of whatever your project is or however you want to finish it off I was actually thinking about adding cutting the paper off right here 
and then continuing on with this. Obviously my ribbon would have to be longer, but you could make this however long you wanted. You could add on, add on to this. Um, but I thought that this was really cute. And then the next thing that I got was this pretty peacock set. Let me take it out of the package for you. Now this, this did come all hooked together and it was really easy to cut it out at first because it was all hooked together. But then when it came to cut out more of these feathers, I needed to break away the feathers and they were right here and then one was on the other side, I think. So this is what my peacock ended up looking like. I think it turned out really good and really pretty. So how I did my peacock, I'll show you guys real quick. I used my, I just put my extra parts into an envelope to use for next time. Is I just, this is the base of the peacock. And then you have these extra pieces right here. They're not extra, I'm sorry. You have those pieces. These are the pieces that you get. You won't get all of those. You only get this size. Let me use some different ones for color purposes. You get a big one, a middle one, and a small one. So those go Those go up here, like that. And then you would cut out your feathers for the bottom part. And I went from the top down and I wish that I wouldn't have done that. I wish that I would have went from the bottom and went up because then I was like trying to shove them up against each other and as you can see I didn't glue them all the way down because I wanted them to look dimensional so I only put the glue on this upper part right here so I wish that I would have started at the bottom and went up so when I make another one that's what I'll be doing so then you just cut these out and then this teeny tiny little piece that you have is for the eye. So that's where you would put it, is right here. And that's how you put the peacock together. So then the next thing that I have is actually not from AliExpress, but I got this at Hobby Lobby. And it is a Sizzix. Um, embossing folder and die set and I honestly I don't like this mermaid I wouldn't recommend getting it because it doesn't come in all the pieces like the other one that I showed you it just comes like this and I had to cut the mermaid apart and cut out so many of this it was very frustrating to put it together but I'll show you what I did with it I'm working on a little flip book that I picked up and I'll show you the page So this is what I ended up doing. You see I cut out the mermaid in many different pieces. But I, you see it's all one piece. So I had to cut apart the mermaid and I and the green is stickles. And so for this part right here, the frame around her, that is another AliExpress die. And I used this die. Sorry for the glare. And it cut out beautifully. So I used this part and this part. And I did have to use a very fine point glue bottle 
to get that. And then this was the extra piece that I had left over on that. So that is what I have for now. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in my next video.